So I got quite a few requests on this topic, and it is which one's better, environmental engineering or environmental science? So if you're watching this video, you're probably either in college deciding whether or not you should major in one or the other, or maybe you're starting your career and you're trying to see whether or not you should switch into different fields. So today in this video, I'm going to be going over what I think is best and realize that this is just my opinion. You're going to be hearing my opinion, my very biased opinion, coming from an environmental engineer covering this topic. Okay, so this is just a warning. That's a disclaimer. So now let's begin. So I'm going to be going over four questions. I think these questions are pretty important into deciding whether or not which is better or if you're trying to compare which is better. And I want to be like broad enough that it can help both college students or people who are just trying to get into this field or people who are trying to switch. So the first one is directed towards college students. The first one is which is easier to major in in college? So the answer is it depends. Some people are just naturally better at one subject than another. So for example, if you're going to be majoring in like environmental engineering, you're going to be dealing with a lot of math, physics, computer programs, and all those other typical things that you would think of when you see like a civil engineer. Realize that environmental engineering is like a subdivision of civil engineering. So when you think of engineers, think about what typical engineers do, right? So like architects, buildings, designs, and all that stuff. If you're not interested in that, then this might not be for you. For environmental scientists, realize that they are scientists. So they'll be dealing with stuff like science, like biology, chemistry, not so much math, not so much like engineering processes, but you will probably be sticking to a lab more so than you would be like stuck in a cubicle compared to environmental engineering. So it depends on how good you are at what they do. For me personally, environmental scientists have it easier than environmental engineers. So to answer your question, environmental science should be easier to major in than environmental engineer. But again, it all depends on how you are as a person. I was just not good at like the technical aspect of like computers and stuff, which is why I had a more difficult time in environmental engineering than I was in science, because I actually enjoyed it. Next question is, are they interchangeable? So for example, if I get a degree in environmental engineering, can I get a job as an environmental scientist? Or vice versa, can I major in environmental science and become an environmental engineer? The answer is yes, you can. I've seen people do both, but, okay, but environmental engineers have a much more easier time to switch jobs than environmental science. So environmental engineers, like, they're more flexible in a way. Environmental engineers, when they major in college, they also have to take, like, you know, general physics, general math, general biology, general chemistry. That's really all you need to do. But for environmental scientists, they take more into, like, you know, the upper divisions of chemistry and biology, but they don't really take much engineering classes. So if you want to become from a scientist to an engineer, you need to know some engineering like courses. You need to know things like AutoCAD and like all these other computer programs that can help with like the civil engineering aspect. So if you had like no background in taking these courses as you're majoring in environmental science, it's gonna be much more difficult for you to jump into like environmental engineering because you didn't have any like background. And I'm pretty sure as an environmental scientist, you don't really apply like these super upper division classes that you took during college. So it's not really necessary for you to take all these like super high classes if you're not going to do it on the job. So in the end, to answer that question, environmental engineering is more flexible. The next question, which is probably the most important question that everyone's sort of worried about, what pays more? Environmental scientists or environmental engineering? Of course people will care about the money and like worry about their future. So this is according to the BLS, this is the Bureau of Labor Statistics, their website, I'll link it down too. According to their website, environmental engineers make 88,000 a year, which is roughly $42 an hour, and environmental scientists, they make like 71,000 a year, or roughly $34 an hour. So that's a pretty huge gap. So this is coming from the internet, you can always Google that. Of course, every single company has its own like different pay scale. So, I mean, you could get more, you could get less, depending on your location, depending on your company. But on average, these are the numbers. And it is clear that environmental engineers make more. Okay, I just want to point that out. Most likely, we make more just because during like college, you had to endure through more. And it sort of goes back to like what you have to go through in college. So engineering itself is pretty high up there in like the prestige and like difficulty. Same thing as like doctors, lawyers, engineers. Those are the ones that are like high paying, high demand, highly stressful, highly difficult to get in. So the more difficult it is, the more pay you get. And lastly, which major has like more field work or like outside work? So as an environmental engineer right now, I'm like mostly stuck in a cubicle. Most of my days are just sitting down in a cubicle and like 
responding to emails. Yes, I do get to go out sometimes just to visit some facilities or maybe walk around my facility if I'm on break, but it's really just like stuck to that location. I'm not moving out like exploring forests or you know, jungles. I'm just visiting like my facility or like a different building. I'm just walking from one building to the next, one office to the next. Mostly on my computer, sitting down like at least six hours out of maybe eight hours a day. So it's not too exciting. I just want to let you know like straight up, this is what we do. Now I cannot answer for an actual environmental scientist, but based off of what I do, that means I know that we're not going out in the field that much. So maybe for an environmental scientist, they might be going out more than me. I want to say that environmental scientists have more outside field work than environmental engineers. I could be wrong. Again, this is just based on my opinion. So if you're like an actual environmental scientist, just like help me out here. Since I know I'm not going out that much, I can only assume that the scientists will be going out more. Alrighty, that's really all I can think of in terms of like some questions that I had in my mind when I was deciding whether or not to major in environmental engineering or environmental science. Let me know if you guys have more questions because this is just what I had. Just like those four basic questions. Either way, both majors like deal with the environmental aspect. You can't really go wrong if you want to go in this very general field. Of course, each field has its own ups and downs, so you know, higher pay, but maybe more stress. Easier to get in. You know, what's an extra like $10,000 a year if you don't enjoy it? So you know, just have like a little balance between life. Pick your field according to like what you enjoy and your current situation. Yeah, okay, so hopefully this helps answer some questions that you have. Alright, goodbye.